Needless to say, the accident and the collapsed bridge will cause chaos for the shipping industry in the short term, whether it's cargo or cruise passengers. Now, Hampton Roads will take up some of that extra duty in the months to come. Both the Port of Virginia and the Half Moon Cruise Terminal are preparing for a surge of ships. Just tonight, it was announced that Carnival will move its Baltimore operations to Norfolk beginning this weekend. Then in your sides, Michelle Wolf has more on the help from Hampton Roads to Baltimore. Michelle? Cargo ships are already detouring away from Baltimore and into Hampton Roads. We've also learned that Carnival Cruise Lines Carnival Legend will begin operating to and from Norfolk. We have got all support ready to roll when they need it. The Commonwealth is jumping into action. Our first step is to make sure that we have we have made available all of the emergency management services that they could use. Uh, that includes, of course, our public safety, uh, all of our emergency management folks. But on top of that, uh, support from VDOT for MDOT, and then finally the support from the port. Virginia Governor Glenn Youngkin is offering aid to Maryland after Tuesday morning's tragedy at the Key Bridge. But this is a reminder, of course, that when a large vessel runs into a bridge, it can cause an extraordinary amount of not just damage, but tragedy. The effects felt nearly 200 miles away in Hampton Roads. Diverting uh, ocean carriers to the Port of Virginia so that it can reduce, of course, eliminate the traffic there, but on top of that, keep, keep uh, trade moving. We have our first uh, ocean carrier that was supposed to be heading to Baltimore, uh, making a stop in Virginia and unloading all of their Baltimore cargo here. Uh, we've got capacity to do it, and I think that's really important. From the Port of Virginia to the Port of Norfolk, beginning on Sunday, March 31st, Carnival Legend will move operations to Norfolk. The city's cruise terminal has been closed to Carnival ships this year to prepare for a $12 million renovation. Next year, the cruise line will establish a home port in the Mermaid City. It's not clear how or if Norfolk's cruise terminal renovation will affect Carnival Legends operations. Michelle Wolf, 10 on your side.